There was a recent FDA um, statement that they they sent actually. So the FDA sent a statement to one of the NMN suppliers saying that they had they were going to classify NMN as a drug rather than as a uh, supplement. I just kind of wanted your opinion on that. Uh, do you think NMN should be classified as a drug? Okay, so that, that's a very important question that has been uh, circulating in the uh, uh, NAD uh, community and the supplement uh, uh, industry. And there, there, there are two ways to, to answer this question. I think you, you have to look at this question from two different angles. The first one is uh, a scientific or med medical uh, question. And the second one is a political and regulatory question. And I, I'll answer the scientific question first. And NMN is such an important uh, uh, supplement that has been available to millions of consumers uh, who are getting, most of them are getting very good uh, benefits for, for their health and longevity. So in my opinion, it must continue. And otherwise we are not taking we are not uh, considering, you know, consumers' interest. And I mean, we 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 know it, this is a very very important uh, nutritional supplement that's beneficial to uh, people's health. Politically, and uh, it's more complicated. I'm I'm not going to comment on, and I can, but I, I'm not going to. And uh, regulatory, the there is a. Uh, a uh, law in the United States, and the law says that if a compound is evaluating, is being evaluating or has been approved as a drug, that compound cannot be used, classified as a supplement. That's what the law says. And whether the FDA ruling has a, scientific, uh, has a legal basis depends on when the application for NMN to be used as a supplement and when NMN is applied to be evaluating as a drug. If the application uh, for NMN to be a drug is before the application for NMN to be used as, as a supplement, the FDA ruling is legal. Otherwise, it's not legal. If the uh, approval for supplement is before the uh, uh, application for, for the to be evaluated as a drug, the FDA has not been very transparent on when the applications were submitted and many organizations are pushing for the information to to determine whether there's actually a legal basis for the FDA ruling. You know, I don't know because I don't have the data. Even if the ruling is legal, in many people's opinion, including me, the FDA should be on the side of the consumer's interest, not on the side of one or a few uh, companies and that are out there to make more money. And I, again, you know, that's my opinion and that's many people's opinion, but what the FDA will do or not is unpredictable. But there is a uh, there, there are multiple uh, precedents uh, that FDA has made exceptions. The most recent exception is a supplement called NAC, and the NAC was ruled. Uh, NAC was approved uh, as the drug in the nineteen fifties, and and has been used as a supplement for decades. In 2021, the FDA ruled that NAC cannot be used as a supplement, but they have reversed the decision and decided not to enforce their ruling. So NAC now can be used as a supplement uh, 
legally in the United States. So we hope that a similar situation, uh, a similar change will occur for NMN, at least that's my hope.